What's up guys, Spectacular Scar Spire 118 here, and today I'd like to take a look back in the past to 2013. Uh, back in that year, uh, I was just starting out as a cosplayer, actually I, I had just started out, and you know, throughout the next couple of months to years, I would, I would take time and, and look on Google at images of uh, Scar Spider cosplays because I wanted to, you know, learn how other people made these amazing costumes I'd look up online. Like, I spent a lot of afternoons and nights as a uh, preteen slash, te slash teenager at the time uh, looking through Google and seeing, like, the RPC Studio suits and, uh, you know, Kane cosplayers. But there's this one Scar Spider cosplayer that really stuck out to me, and it's the one I'm covering in this video. And the reason that I, I'm calling it the the like Scarlet Spider 2013 suit is because this costume, a lot of the images that, that are uh, out about this costume uh, originate from the year 2013, specifically at C2E2. And I don't know this cosplayer's name. That's the, uh, the funny thing about it. And so uh, this cosplayer uses uh, an undersuit from uh, Spidey for fun. If you guys don't know who Spidey for Fun is, he does a lot of replica suits. He works on Raimi suits. Uh, he's done Tasm 2 suits. Uh, if you guys have ever seen uh, Super Power Beat Town, uh, their video with Darth Maul versus Spider-Man. Uh, also, I, I wanted to quickly say I have allergies, so my nose is a little stuffed right now, guys. So if I sound a little off, that's uh, it's like the equivalent of having a cold. So I'm so sorry if I sound a little off in today's video, but... Uh, just a little side note, but he makes a lot of good suits, and you guys know his work because I use his urethane spider emblems for my uh, Ben Riley Scarlet Spider hoodie, and the reason that I did that is because I saw that the, that he had done the emblems on this guy's costume, so you can really see where the inspiration is coming from for a lot of things for me that have come to fruition with my own cosplays. Uh, but this cosplayer, he's, his costume is just perfect. His, so the undersuit's from Spidey for Fun, and the lenses are, sp for, are from Spidey for Fun, and the emblems that are on his hoodie are from Spidey for Fun. So I just wanted to highlight this cosplayer because now that it's my 10th anniversary cosplay, and I really kind of want to show you guys where a lot of my inspiration comes from. Now, of course, the lenses aren't necessarily comic accurate, uh, given the fact that they have frames to it, and, and uh, Ben's suit really doesn't have frames to it. Uh, when you really look at it, but I really kind of want to highlight this because to me it was the perfect Scarlet Spider suit, and you even see the the influence that it had on my first uh, uh, Zentai Zentai Scarlet Spider suit with the lenses kind of being the same shape. Uh, they're definitely on a smaller scale though. I just I really love everything about it. Like the the base suit itself, I, I believe is on. Uh, you know, dye sub, it's not color fabric, so the colors are a little uh, diluted, but also they, they kind of change depending on the lighting. The hoodie color is actually magnificent. Like, the, the shade of blue is perfect, and it's really interesting because the depending on the lighting that it's in, based on the pictures that I've seen of it, it can go from a very light cyan color to a very light sky blue color, and so I just, I've never been able to kind of uh, emulate that whenever I've done a Scarlet Spider hoodie in the past, which I'm envious of because I, I really do enjoy the shade of blue compared to the red color. And don't even get me started on uh, the web shooters and the belt and the ankle pouches. They're just perfect. And I recently figured out how he did those web shooters, or at least my theory to how he did it, because another Scarlet Spider cosplayer in the same year posted a method of, of using plastic test tubes uh, to make Ben Riley's web shoes, and it's just genius, and it all comes together super well. This costume, in my opinion, has a legacy to it, and I remember watching the C2E2 interview that a channel did with the cosplayer. I just wish I knew his name. If you guys know anything about this cosplayer, please let me know down below. If I can reach out to him, I'd love to talk to him. I'd love to interview him even. Uh, I know Spidey for fun that he got a suit from, is a great guy his name's also brad conveniently which is kind of funny but he's a great guy and uh you know working with him in the past has been nice but i'm sure it was really good for uh 
whoever this cosplayer is. Regardless of that, though, I just wanted to kind of show you guys a lot of where my inspiration comes from. And I just think that this is the perfect Scars Fire costume. These pictures, I even sent one of these pictures back in the day before I, uh, I think it was, it might have been before I found Zentai Zentai or Zentai Zone. But I remember sending the RPC Studios an email and I said, hey, could you guys replicate this suit? And this is before they even had a Scarlet Spider suit on their website. This is like 2014, 2015, I think. And they were like, yeah, we can replicate that. But, you know, obviously they would have overcharged for it let's be honest guys and plus uh it wouldn't be the same quality anyways guys that about wraps up this video just a little nostalgia video covering a costume and a cosplayer that i really looked up to back in the day uh if you guys again know anything about this guy please let me know down below i was thinking about reaching out to spider for fun maybe and asking him but i don't know if he has client confidentiality or whatever i don't know if that's a thing for him but Thanks for watching, like and subscribe, uh, follow me on Instagram at Spectacular Scar Spire, or use code SCAR118 at printcosting.com for 15% off your order. Not only does that help you save money, but it also helps me show you guys that they are truly worth it. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Spectacular Scar Spire, 118, out.